Republicans in Colorado are calling on the state party chair, Dave Williams, to step down. Williams is also running for Congress in El Paso County. News 5's Andy Cohen is joining us now with an update on this story. Andy. Diane, I just spoke with the Republican Party chair from Jefferson County, who sent out a press release today calling for Chairman Williams to resign. She said the discontent has been building and that Monday's anti-Pride Month email was the straw that broke the camel's back. Jefferson County Republican Party Chair Nancy Palazzi wrote Friday that State Party Chair Dave Williams has encouraged division rather than unity. She pointed to multiple emails issued from the party headquarters endorsing candidates in primary races, breaking precedent of respecting primary neutrality. She also said that he demanded candidates complete a survey of political issues to determine if they would receive an endorsement. And she said Monday's anti-Pride Month email was not appropriate given that Williams, in his role, is speaking on behalf of all colleagues. Colorado Republicans. In my eyes, it was disgusting. <laughs> I, I don't, um, that was not something that he should have said publicly and using the Republican platform. If that went out personally by Dave Williams with his personal email, I have no problem with that. That is him doing that. But as our elected chairman, that is not an appropriate message to be sending out to the public. I received the following statement from Colorado GOP Vice Chairwoman Hope Sheppelman. It reads, quote, we make no apologies for standing against Pride Month as it is a destructive agenda that harms children and undermines parental authority. And if certain weak Republicans like Nancy Pelosi want to side with a movement that promotes transgender chemical castration and genital mutilation, then we look forward to notifying their base membership of that disgraceful fact. Jeffco Party Chair Palazzi says that she is in the process of gathering signatures in support for this demand for resignation. Over the weekend, she plans to send an updated press release on Monday with the many party leaders who would like to see Williams step down. Diane? To be continued.